reaching the age of adolescence. Introduction Earlier you learnt that the endocrine glands directly secrete hormones into the bloodstream. The pituitary stimulates the testes and the ovaries to secrete the sex hormones. Therefore, the pituitary, testes and ovaries are all endocrine glands. Apart from these three, there are other endocrine glands also present in the body. Let us have a look at those today. Hormones other than sex hormones The endocrine glands in the body are the thyroid gland, pancreas, adrenal glands, testis, ovaries and the pituitary. We know the testes secrete the male sex hormone, testosterone, and the ovaries secrete the female sex hormone, estrogen. These bring about reproductive maturity in adolescence. The thyroid gland is a butterfly-shaped gland located at the base of our necks. It secretes the hormone, Thyroxine. When the thyroid gland does not produce enough thyroxine, the throat of the person bulges and becomes big. This disease is called as goiter. Have you heard your uncle or grandfather saying that they have diabetes? Diabetes is caused when the pancreas, which is located behind the stomach, fail to secrete the hormone insulin. Insulin maintains the sugar level in our blood, especially after we eat. The adrenal glands are cap-shaped glands placed above the kidneys. The adrenal glands secrete a hormone that maintains the salt balance in our blood. It also secretes another hormone called adrenaline that helps the body during stressful conditions. Adrenaline is secreted when we are angry, worried and embarrassed or when the body is in the fight or flight mode. The pituitary is the master gland of the body. It controls the secretion of most of the endocrine glands in the body. Thyroid and adrenal glands secrete their respective hormones only after they receive orders from the pituitary. The growth hormone, which is necessary for the normal growth of a person, is also secreted by the pituitary. Role of Hormones in the Life Cycle of Insects and Frogs Apart from human beings, hormones also play an important role in the life of other animals. In the life cycle of the silk moth, the caterpillar has to pass through various stages to become an adult moth. The change from larvae to an adult is called metamorphosis. The metamorphosis in silk moth is controlled by insect hormones. In frogs, metamorphosis is controlled by the hormone thyroxine.
the water in which the tadpoles are growing needs to contain iodine as iodine is necessary for the production of thyroxine. Thus, the growth of tadpoles into adult frogs is facilitated by thyroxine. Let us summarize what we have learned. Apart from ovaries and testes, there are other endocrine glands. Thyroid, adrenal and pancreas are endocrine glands. Pituitary is the master endocrine gland. It controls the secretion of all the other hormones. Thyroxine is secreted by the thyroid hormone. Adrenaline by the adrenal glands. Insulin is secreted by the pancreas. Growth hormone is secreted by the pituitary. Metamorphosis in the life of the silkworm is carried out by insect hormones. The growth of a tadpole into an adult frog takes place only in the presence of thyroxine hormone.